musician. We're the Boyle Heights Community Youth Orchestra. If we build it, they will come. So we put a sign up on the door and we were hoping for 20. On the first day, we got 40. And as more and more kids came, they brought their sisters and their brothers and their cousins and their neighbors. And we ended up with 62 with a waiting list of about 20. It was really exciting. I know we could have gotten to at least 80. We just didn't have the space or the instruments. Like when I come to orchestra, I feel so happy. I'm gonna learn something new. I get to learn about an instrument for free. When I opened the case, I was excited because it was my first time holding a violin. And I just didn't want to let go of it. So they come in without a background in music. It's just not offered at the elementary schools now. But with us, they learn how to read music. Well, in our school, we don't have a, we used to have a music class, but then they cut it off now, so we don't have any of this stuff now. No violence, no, well, nothing. The irony of the cuts is just absolutely incomprehensible because there's been more research and more money has been spent proving that music instruction increases academic performance. Students engaged in a music program score as many as 20 to 30 points higher on an SAT. Before I started with the orchestra a year and a half ago, I had really low grades. My mom found out about this, the orchestra. She put me in because she thought it would be better for my grades, and she was right. Now, now that I'm advanced, I get to go to a better school. We're learning like math because it said one and two and three and four. One and two and three and four. When you're playing an instrument and you're reading music, more of the brain is lit up than any other activity. Music teaches the two sides of the brain to talk to itself. It actually physically builds synapses between the two halves of the brain. So the students who start th at this age are creating pathways for neural transmission that will stay with them for the rest of their lives. They will always be better at activities that require coordination, formal thought, logic, discipline, focus, all those things. Because at this age, the two halves of the brain are talking. Playing music makes me feel smarter. It makes me feel like if I was intelligent. When you work in an area of lower socioeconomic, lower performing schools, many of those people called experts come in and tell you what you should or shouldn't do. One of the experts told me that I should be teaching steel drumming ensemble because uh, inner city students really weren't capable of learning an orchestral instrument. He didn't have the vision that every child has unlimited potential and we just have to give them the opportunity. And that's what our orchestra does. It provides that opportunity and levels the playing field so that these kids can have the same experience as a child in a wealthier neighborhood. They say build schools and not prisons, and we say build orchestras and not prisons. The best thing is that I get to play an instrument and make new friends. I think they learned that the most important part of being in an orchestra is working as a team. When we're all playing together, the orchestra is like being in the family. When the orchestra is doing what it's supposed to do, it's agreeing with itself, it's harmony. And when students learn that in a group setting where they're feeling safe and they're feeling loved, then they're going to carry that with them the rest of their lives and their brain is going to be full of this harmony. working hard and we want to do so much with our music to the community. Please support us!